Serie A kicks off this weekend. Minorizuki joins us to look ahead to the start of a new campaign in Italy. No surprise as who is the favourite to win it once again. It is Juventus. Before we go into details as to who might take that title away from them or how Juve are going to set up, let's start off with Maurizio Sarri, uh, who's, of course, ruled out for this weekend, Mina. Yeah, unfortunately he is. We know that he's been suffering from pneumonia. He wasn't available for the Frenier against Triestina, and everyone was wondering whether or not he'd be fit and healthy enough to sit on the bench against Padma this opening weekend. But uh, Juventus today announced that uh, they, they want their coach to recover. And in order to put him in the best position to do that, he won't be available for the Parma game and he won't be sitting on the bench in the second match of the season, which is the big one. Mm. It's against Napoli, his former team. So that's a huge loss more than anything um, because that's a really important match and they'll be expecting to do something special already from the second game of the season. And he won't be there. From a player's perspective, how much of a difference well, does, it, does this actually make? I'd like to think as a one-off. I never experienced my coach, stroke manager, not being there. I'd like to think some of the teams that I played in would have been able to cope right. on a, on a one-off basis because we had a strong dressing room and, and good good backroom staff. However, it has to have an effect, otherwise the, the coach's job is obsolete. Mm. Because a coach is there to change things during the game when it's not going well. Mm. And to make those, you know, small detail changes and he doesn't always think the same as the number two mm -hmm. or his assistant. So it is important, particularly the game against his, his old club, Napoli, which could come down to some tactical changes during the game. So, yeah, I think it's, it, 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 could, it could potentially be big. And it's not just like autopilot, just kind of carry on where you were last season, because Sarri obviously just has been there a couple of months. Correct. So it affects the preparation and it affects what is it that you want to do. Because as much as the number two comes in, the assistant, and says he has a plan, and maybe this is a plan that has been sort of handed down by Sarri, said this is what we want to do. Well, Sarri's not there to actually say, no, look, the difference is in the details, the difference is in the movement, the difference is in the things that I want you to do. There's also something to be said about instincts of a coach during a game. The evaluation of a player by a coach during the game and saying, okay, this guy... I'm expecting something else from him. He's not doing it. Maybe I make this change. Maybe I rotate the team differently. Maybe I read the game differently than one my assistant would. And in doing so, you have to trust that the guy who you're giving the reins to would be able to make those decisions. When that guy's not there, of course it makes a difference. Yeah. Short term, not a big deal. If this is long term, now we have a problem. From a coach's perspective, how does it kind of, how would it all play out? Well, the, what it is, you've got that's the reason you've got pre-season. You put all, all the all the plans in on your pre-season work, so you work really closely with your number one and, and, and your number two. That that's what you do. Yes, you're absolutely right. That you're not on the same, but you do th see the game differently. The key, as Ali and Craig have said, is the in-game management. When you've got to make those decisions where it's not going as well as we expected it to. What changes do we make, or do I make, right. if, if I'm the number two? So that's, that's the difference, in-game management. And a lot of coaches, it's very difficult to teach in-game. You've got to have that sense, you've got to have that knowledge of, you know, as a boy say, he's not doing it, what do I do, where do we switch? That, that, that's the key uh, to, to, to that situation. 